I have 52 minutes left to my phone. So, which is good, obviously. So I'll babble on for another 30 minutes. And then the remaining 22 minutes, I'll read four to five pages of Lord of the Rings. I was on page. What page was I on? Give me a sec here. I read four pages. Four pages last time, right? So one, two, three, four. So I'm on page 180. I will read up to page 183 or 184. I'll read four to five pages a day. And then the next day I'll finish off what? The next day I'll finish off the remaining chapter, obviously. Nine, four, yeah. I don't know. In a good two two more parts, I'll finish. The bear down chapter is a little longer than usual. Today I'll re I don't feel like reading too much. Today I'll read four pages. And tomorrow I'll read another four or five pages. And then the day after that I'll finish off uh, the bear announced chapter, obviously. And I'm moving on to chapter nine. So sometime out on October 20th around I'll be done my Lord of the Rings read along. So I'll babble on for a good 30 minutes here. Because you guys love because I have 52 minutes left on my phone. And then the remaining 22 minutes, I'll read four pages of, uh, of, of Lord of the Rings. Only four pages. I don't feel like reading too much today. Which is when Frodo and them go through the bear announce. Yeah, man, you guys already know how top-notch of... I'm going to keep saying this, man. You guys already know how top-notch of a Sky Source company me and my wife are going to own. You're looking at a company bigger than Disney, Warner Bros., Paramount, Universal, you know what I'm saying? You're looking at a company bigger than all these companies. You're looking at a high-end, top-notch office me and my wife are going to own. Me and my wife don't have to, don't have to build a luxury office, but I, wanna, I personally want to have a luxury office. I'm going to put a good $6 million towards building my office. For me and my wife and the seven team, I'm gonna put a good like seven to seven million is enough, seven to ten million towards building the building for the special effects team. You're looking at a top high end building. The special effects team building won't be as luxury, obviously, because that's where they're all working. But my office where me, my, me and my wife and the seven team are working, you're looking at a luxury office, man. And so when these actors walk in the office, they're like, holy shit, man, Skies is a top much company. You're looking at a top high end office. I'm gonna have a couch where the actors sit down. Obviously, I'm not gonna have the I'm not gonna fly in the actors' agents. No, what I'll do is whenever the actors c come to negotiate the contract, I'll have their what? I'll have their agents on a conference call. It's much easier that way. Obviously, I'm not gonna fly in the actors with their agents. No, I'll have the actors' agents be on a phone on a conference call. So whenever me, whenever me and my wife negotiate to deal with the actors, the agents will be on the conference call. Obviously, with the actors. Obviously, that's the easier way to do it. Obviously. And all the agents representing the actors, um, I can have them, if they want to watch production, they're more than welcome to watch production. They can watch all production. I can pay for their, for their hotel, for, for, for their what? For their, for their trailer and their feeding, if they, if they want to watch production, obviously. And I can have them be a part of the, the luxury hotel party event, obviously. So even though they're going to be left behind because they're not going to experience the, the, the all, uh, they're not going to experience my, my what? My, they're not going to experience what? Probably up my condo and all that stuff to fame. They at least get they at least get to experience the what the what the luxury hotel part, which is nice, and the red carpet. They'll be watching the red carpet, obviously. So they'll be what they get to watch the red carpet, and they also get the what they also get to experience what they also get to experience what the luxury what the luxury hotel part, obviously. But there's a good chance a lot of the agents won't be able to watch production because a lot of agents that rep a lot of agents represent multiple actors. Hence, they're gonna, they're, they, hence, they have to work, obviously. Hence, a lot of them won't even have time to watch production. There's a good chance a lot of the agents... What I'll do for the agents, the agents... I'll just have the agents be a part of the luxury hotel party and the red carpet, and that's good enough. And there's a good chance the dog team will be filming some of the agents, too. Like, for example, when the... When the, when the or, I, you, know, you don't have to film the agents. When the, but I want to do a thing. Whenever the, whenever the agents give their actors a call, they say, hey, look, you've been cast over the role. I want the dog team filming that. Behind the scenes, obviously, which I think is pretty cool. And you guys already know how top notch of a Sky Source company me and Marvel are on. You're looking at a top line company, man. <coughs> a company, a company that will blow Disney film suits out of the water, blow Warner Bros. out of the water. These companies are big, man. Blow Warner Bros. out of the water, blow blow Disney film suits out of the water, blow Lionsgate out of the water, blow Netflix out of the water. We'll blow what? Fox? Well, Disney bought Fox now. What? Blow Universal out of the water. Blow Paramount out of the water. Blow Sony Columbia's Pitch out of the water. 
Skysales will blow all these companies out of the water, obviously. The only thing cooler about Hollywood is that Hollywood, the movies will be released on theaters. Hollywood, you get to see the movie in, in a theatrical experience on theaters. That's the only thing that's cooler about what? About what? About what? About Hollywood, obviously. Where Sky Source is direct to 4K Blu-ray, obviously. But I have no choice. The only way, the only way, I can easily release movies on theaters. I can easily, me and my wife can easily spend hundreds of millions of dollars or billions of dollars. We can easily build movie theater on our own. We can easily have our own movie theater chain all around the world. We can build <coughs> our own movie theaters all around the world. And we can easily release our movies on theaters first, then release on 4K. But we make more money, obviously. But I told you, to release theaters all, to, to build movie theaters all, movie theaters chains all around the world would cost me and my wife billions. Billions of dollars, and movie theater chains are very expensive. You would have to hire a thousand employees, and, and it become, I told you, it becomes crazy. It's, at, it's not asset based business, obviously, and a modern found asset based business. At the same time, it's a waste of money building movie theaters for just one movie. For, for, so if I play just one, only my movies in theaters, it's a waste of money building a movie theater just to play one movie. Hence why, I, hence why me and my wife are not going to do that, obviously. As the easiest choice, my two choices are either releasing online. On my website, or I, I sell it on 4K Blu-ray on Amazon. Those are my two choices, obviously. So the only cool thing about Hollywood is that Hollywood, you get to see the movie on theaters. Hollywood, you get to see the movie on theaters. At the same time, you get the public eye fame. You get the you get the news of the movies. You get you get my movie will have crazy fame and buzz, but it's behind the scenes fame, obviously. Whereas Hollywood, you get you get the public eye fame. Same time, the you, you know what I'm saying you you, you get you, the movies get are released on theaters. Which is fucking cool. It's cool to see movie on theaters. Whereas my movies, my movie, you, you what, will be released on 4K Blu-ray only on Amazon. Obviously, so when you when you see, for all my movies, when you see the trailer, so when you see the Zayas trailer, I'm gonna hire someone to speak. Get it now, only on 4K Blu-ray, only exclusively on Amazon. Looks something top notch. That's why our company's unique. Get it now, only on 4K Blu-ray, only on only exclusively on Amazon. Looks something top notch. <laughs> You're gonna get something top much on trade. So the only cool thing about Hollywood is that Hollywood, the movies get released on theaters, and you get the public eye fame, you get the paparazzi. Whereas my company, you get the fame, obviously, but it's behind the scene fame, obviously. I told you, there's a, these actors are gonna get interviewed by media all around the world. Once filming's finished, you're gonna get interviewed by media all around America. You look at something fucking crazy. Churches. All that stuff. For the last time I was saying, it's like something fucking crazy. They won't mention my name. They're going to be like, oh my God. But they're going to talk about the, the process. How is it like filming this movie? How is it like working for the boss? You know what I'm saying? How scary, how scary, how scary is he, man? How scary is the wolf? You know what I'm saying? They're going to ask him all these questions. They're not going to mention my name, but they're going to talk about it. They're going to talk about it, obviously. Who knows? I might be wrong. Maybe these actors might not get interviewed. I don't know. Maybe because of why. But I guarantee you the media are going to want to interview them. You look at something crazy, but because it's because of why you look, it's behind the scene fame, obviously, which is better in my opinion. Anyways, being famous behind the scenes is much better than, than the public eye fame, obviously, <coughs> in my opinion, obviously. See, right? But I told you, hence why I recommend all you average people around the world, all you people around the world watching this, I recommend you guys put money into a theater system, obviously, because my movie is released on 4K Blu-ray. You want to get a home theatrical spirit, a theatrical spirit, you need to you need to put money into a theater system. For fifteen hundred bucks, two thousand, twenty five hundred dollars, you can get a good home theater system for yourself. Obviously, right? And I recommend you get a big screen TV too. If you want to get a better experience, I recommend you get a, a nice big screen TV. You you can get you can get nice big screen TVs for a good six hundred bucks at stores these days. A lot of good deals for big screen TVs, obviously. I recommend you get a big screen TV. If you want to get a nice theatrical experience, you need to watch it on the big screen TV, obviously. And I recommend you get a theater system, which a lot of people around the world will, obviously. Hence, that's more money for the theater companies, obviously. A lot of the theater companies are going to make a lot of money. All the t all the whole, all the TV companies are going to make a lot of money. A lot of people are going to be buying are going to be buying what big screen TVs when when my movie's about to be released, obviously. A lot of people are going to be putting money into a home theater system when my movie gets released. You're looking at you're looking at what I'm boosting the economy, obviously. The same time when my doc gets released and my movie gets released, this is more money for the stores and all the restaurants. As a lot of people are going to buy beer, popcorn, order pizza, order McDonald's, order order Wendy's, order Popeyes, Louisiana chicken, order shawarma, order pizza, 
order food, you know what I'm saying, has some more money for the stores, has some boost in the economy. So all these business owners who own restaurants, who own all these stores, more money for them, as when my doc and movie gets released, everyone guarantees is going to go to the store, order pizza, get beer, get drinks, get popcorn. You know what I'm saying? They're all going to get food. They're all going to order food and get takeout, get food, get popcorn, all that stuff. And it's more money for the stores, obviously. <coughs> and Sky Stores will be really boosting the economy around the world, obviously. I'm going to be boosting the economy in Canada because I'm gonna, me and my wife are going to pay billions of dollars in taxes. And so I'm boosting the economy in Vancouver like crazy. You know what I'm saying? Hospitals, schools, parks, roads, bridges, the metro, train metro system, all that stuff. Me and my wife will really be boosting the Amazon and Sky will be boosting the economy, obviously, a lot, obviously, because we're going to pay billions in taxes, obviously. Hence why me and my wife are going to receive hundreds of millions of dollars in tax returns, because we paid billions of dollars in taxes, obviously. And I'm all for paying taxes. I'm not a fan of evading taxes. I'm not a fan of getting control with the law, with the IRS, all that stuff. I recommend, I, I'm all for paying taxes. It's good to help out the economy, obviously. As I'm not, I'm not one of those anti-tax people. I am all for paying my taxes, obviously. Because I'm making billions, it's fair that you that you give back to the economy and you pay your taxes, obviously. Even though I know the government can be corrupt and greedy and all that stuff, pay your taxes, that way you contribute to the economy, obviously. And there's nothing worse than you making all this money and you're not helping out the economy. No. Contribute to the economy. The more the more the more bridges you build, the more hospitals you build, you know what I'm saying, the more schools you build, that's more money for the for the businesses, obviously. And you're boosting the economy, which is good, obviously. And it's not just me and my wife who will benefit. A lot of people around the world are going to benefit because me and my wife are going to be boosting the economy for the home theater companies, restaurants, stores, beer stores, all that stuff. Boosting the economy for all those companies. As once my documentary is about to be released, a lot of people are going to buy beer. A lot of people are going to order food, get popcorn. You look, it's going to be, you're looking at something crazy. And so we boot hunts. Me and my wife will be boosting the economy. Amazon and Sky will be boosting the economy, which is good, obviously. <clears throat> I'll be boosting the economy for Boston Pizza. As for my takeouts, me and my wife are gonna spend a good, I don't know, two hundred thousand dollars on for the takeouts, and that's a lot of money for that one restaurant, obviously. As I'll be boosting the economy for that for for that one Boston Pizza restaurant that that that, that, that I'm gonna book for my takeouts. In Vancouver, I'm going to be boosting the economy for that one restaurant as me and my wife are going to spend a good like $200,000 for the takeouts, man. Because uh, me and my wife are going to be doing takeouts our first year, obviously. We're not going to do that much takeouts the first year, but we're going to do quite a few takeouts the first year. 